Hey everybody, this is Brian. Just recording a quick recap from class. We had um, 4X Live class this morning. It's Thursday, November 14th. And uh, we placed a couple of trades. We placed a buy and sell on the Euro USD. We placed a buy on the pound USD and a uh, buy on the US Yen. Uh, but the, uh, the flip side of that was we had news coming up um, within, uh, within an hour of class. So uh, we had a couple of trades we put on, but then getting close to news, we ended up taking them off and uh, waiting until after news. So um, here's what happened for the day. We had our, our buy and our sell that we put on on the uh, Euro USD. We had a buy here at 34.42, and we had a sell at 34.56. Uh, during class, this kind of popped down. It looked like it was behaving, and uh, I went ahead and just... Um, you know, took off my, my pips when I went pro positive. We were about 10 minutes prior to news. Didn't want to be in for the whip because it's anybody's game at that point. So we uh, we opted just to take that trade off. Right as I was taking this trade off, the, our uh, price moved up right to the buy order area and uh, moved back down. But I took that trade off as well. And just uh, just to ensure that I, I wasn't in, you know, both of these trades ended up going in our direction and working in our favor, but they could have just as easily not worked out for us, which is why it was important with news coming up that we control our risk and uh, take those uh, took those orders off the table. The uh, pound order never triggered. We had a, a buy order in down at uh, 6044. Didn't trigger prior to news. Never came back to that area even post news. So uh, this was the area I was most interested in trading. Remember, 6044 was a three of three channel. So if uh, during news or uh, even right after the news, if, if price had come back down to this channel level, I would have looked to buy it at 60.44, but price never got there, so we went ahead and closed that trade down. And um, same with the uh, US yen, we had a three of three channel at 99.67, and um, we were we were looking after news. If price floated back down to this level, we would go back in. Didn't ever get there, so we took that order off as well. So ultimately, it was just kind of an even day for us. Uh, we had a couple of good good trading levels, but with the news aspect, uh, the announcement uh, that was occurring today, the testimony by um, you know the the Fed chairman designate. Uh, Yellen, we uh, we opted to take our trades off, wait till after news. We didn't have any uh, solid entry points at that point, so we just kind of had a level day. So hey, you know we uh, we have opportunities sometimes to make lots of pips. Sometimes we don't uh, don't don't make pips. Sometimes we lose pips. That's part of trading, and we just have to manage our risk appropriately. So we did that today by uh, by staying out of the market and uh, letting letting this thing play out. So we'll be back in tomorrow, and we'll uh, record a recap for you as we have our, our success. We'll talk to you soon. You guys have a great one.